I thought we were very, very fortunate to get, get a win tonight uh, against a very talented and, and physical Laval University team. Uh, I thought they came out, they executed their stuff, and they really imposed their will for uh, just over three quarters of the game. We were fortunate in the end that uh, our experienced players stepped up, made plays. We got some great contribution in the fourth quarter from Chris Avenant and uh, snuck out a win here uh, up here in Quebec City. Night where you all really struggled shooting the ball, just 7% from three point range heading into the fourth quarter, finished the game. Uh, at about 29% while the ball was at 42%. Thoughts on that? Yeah, I, I just thought we were out of rhythm a little bit all, all evening long. We had some makeable shots, uh, just didn't go in. We, we missed some layups, we missed some free throws uh, from some very, very good free throw shooters. So I just think we were just a half a click off and uh, hadn't found our rhythm yet. Luckily, uh, we made enough winning basketball plays, both on the defensive end and on the, on the offensive end, uh, to sneak out of here with a win. There's a bright spot, Quincy Ford with 26 points on 10 of 14 shooting. Yeah, Quincy really, really played well. Uh, he, you know, he got some runouts and some steals and some open court layups, and uh, that really kind of gets his game going. And then he made a couple of big baskets right when we needed it. Uh, stepped up and made some free throws. So it was really hard. Uh, it was really uh, impressive and. and uh, inspiring to see him play that way, especially when they were in a close basketball game when we needed him most. Encouraging to see some upperclassmen uh, step up big in the, in the fourth quarter. Lee with two three-pointers, Avenon, as you mentioned, with a couple of big baskets. Sure, Johns, Johns hasn't really gotten in the rhythm. I mean, yesterday we kind of saved him in the rotation down at Bishops, and tonight he got in early foul trouble, and I think that just, you, you know, it, 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 uh, sometimes it can get a player off track. But, John's is extremely mentally tough, and at the end of the game, uh, you know, he reverted to the old John and made the plays that we needed him to make. Thoughts heading into tomorrow's game? Well, I just, uh, you know, I want to improve on, on uh, this evening's execution. I want to make sure we're, we're matching the other team's physicality and, and energy level. Um, and again, you know, our experienced players have to show the way. And uh, guys like Chris Avenant, uh, you know, that's what, he, that's what he can bring to this team, some energy and, and so on. But when you have leaders like John and Joel and Quincy and Reggie, uh, you're, you're in good shape and I, I'm in good hands when, when we're in close basketball games.